With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. So this is the question. We are given the radii of the basis of basically of two right circular solid and the radii of the basis of two cones of same height, they are the same height, are R1 and R2 respectively. The cones are melted and recast into solid sphere of radius R. Show that the height of the each cone is given by here h is equal to 4r cube divided by r1 square. This is square, okay? So here r1 square plus r2 square. Okay, this is not 2. This is square actually, okay? So now, let, first of all, here we have given the h. So let h be the height of the cone. Let h be the height of the cone. Okay. So here h equals to the height of the cone. Cone, okay? So now, if you see that the sum of the volumes of two coins is equal to the volume of the spheres, so we can say that the sum of uh, the sum of volumes of sum of volumes of two coins is equal to the volume of the sphere. The volume of the sphere. Okay. So now this implies that. That is, we are given the radius of the coin, con, okay. So here we have 1 by 3 pi r1 square h, okay. Now plus, here we have 1 by 3 pi r2 square h is equals to 4 by 3 pi r cube, okay. And now this implies that here we have, if we take out the common, so 1 by 3 pi h. Here R1 square plus R2 square is equals to 4 by 3 pi R cube. Okay. So now if you see that this will cancel out and here we are left with that is we have 4 that is H R1 square plus R2 square is equals to 4 R cube. Now this implies that nothing we are left with. That is h is equals to 4r cube divided by r1 square plus r2 square. Okay, so this is our final answer. Okay, so thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.